Ladies and gentlemen, V-Jump Leaks are here. We've got some spicy stuff. We've got a new unit and we got a Zenkai. And then also what this new unit and Zenkai might mean for what we'll get in November, especially in terms of LFs. I'll talk about that after I go over both of these new things and my kind of thoughts on all of that. But let's start out with actually the Zenkai for purple Janemba here, which is the Janemba that has a green card where if they tap blast or blast attack you, you activate the green card, the like blast flies into like the dimensional portal thing and the Janemba hits him back and you can combo into it. He also has the blue card that's like an AOE type blue card, so that's that's the Janemba we're talking about here, the purple one. Uh, we don't know a lot about him. We know that he'll be buffing purple powerful opponent, which is interesting. That does of course buff the LF perfect sale we just got for our monthly October LF. So that's cool. It's interesting they decided to go with Powerful Opponent instead of Regen. Certainly should be interesting. I'll get into a little bit more on why I think that in a second. But as for his kit, we really only know that he will be giving buffs for certain things happening in the battle. And that's really it. They may touch upon it tomorrow as we have a video and stuff. They may go over more detail on it. Uh, or they may not. I'm, not. I'm really not sure because we got this just before that's coming out so i guess we'll have to see if they cover it if they don't they don't we'll just have to wait and see when he comes out for it but if they do cover it that's great we'll find out sooner but that's really it for janemba not a whole lot there up here though is the more exciting stuff i'd say we're getting a red piccolo fused with nail which is interesting he's from the cooler's revenge movie which is this movie with big boy bad boy cooler cooler the baller who was wearing a mask before he needed to but actually, you can see in the Piccolo art here, you can see Thouser in the background. One of cool, he's like Cooler's like right hand man, essentially. Um, you can see Thouser getting beat up here as well. Piccolo's arms being long and stretchy. And you can't really tell at all here because it's like the glare. Like the person who took the picture of the V Jump page, there was clearly some lens, you know, glare going on here. But there's like a purple like legs you can kind of see flying away here so i would assume that it's thouser getting hit by piccolo and with like an elbow or something in this picture as well since thouser was in all the other you know pictures on the screen but interesting decision i will assume piccolo will probably be buffing like region and movies that would be my guess for what we'll you know be seeing him buff he'll probably be coming out in an all-star banner as well he seems you know like an all-star unit who would come with him I honestly, I, I don't know. Like, I doubt I doubt it's going to be Cooler from the movie. I feel like... I feel like Cooler could deserve an LF at this point. Because Cooler's a pretty hype character. Lots of people like Cooler. He's, he's just a hype unit. I feel like Cooler could definitely be, like, an LF-deserving unit. So I, I also just don't feel like they'd throw him with the Piccolo. That would just kind of seem weird to me. Um, they could throw in a Thouser. Uh or however you want to pronounce it. I don't know if that's a weird pronunciation or not, but that's just how I've heard it, so it's what I'm calling him. Um, but, yeah, that would kind of be pretty lame, to be honest. I don't know how many people would really want a Piccolo and Thouser type of All-Star banner, but uh, it'll be interesting to see who they throw with it, because there'll definitely be another unit alongside him on that. But what does this mean? What does this mean uh, for us in terms of November? Because we got our October monthly LF, what are we going to see in November? Now, of course, video and stuff tomorrow will possibly said shed. Shed? Yeah. Shed, I said said, and then shed. Yeah, whatever. You get it. Possibly shed some light on that. They may discuss things. Like, they may discuss uh, how they're going to do November, if we're going to get a November monthly LF, and then Black Friday is going to be its own separate thing, which I think might be the case, because we had uh, third anniversary. And, you know, third anniversary LFs were... Zerp Marge Zamasu Corrupted and Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. And then we also got Gohan, who they called, you know, part of the third anniversary extravaganza. But I think he was mainly more the monthly LF for June. He just came out during the third anniversary, and they like to throw things that come out during the third anniversary into the third anniversary and all that. So I could see them giving us either a monthly LF and then two LFs for Black Friday, or just one other LF for Black Friday, something like that. I will have to see if they like explain what's going to happen in the video and stuff or just if they don't when it happens if it happens if we get a LF for November or not but if we do get a LF for November I could potentially see it being cooler because we're getting a piccolo from that movie presumably it'll be someone else from that movie as well on the banner with piccolo and then they decided to make Janemba buff powerful opponent instead of regen now, when we go look at 
you know, the regen tag, which you know, I'm assuming uh, the red piccolo will probably be on. I'd say that's pro or, you know, hell, at least buffed. I'll say that's probably pretty helpful because, yeah, I guess you can run Zamasu. He doesn't buff the tag, and you kind of want people who buff the tag for extra buffs. Uh, he's just not really... Revival Cell's really just not hitting anymore, and the other reds are pretty uh, shocking, to be honest. They're all pretty shocking for regen, so getting a new red for regen I think would be pretty nice. Uh, they just, like, yeah, there's just not really a lot going on besides Zamasu. I guess he doesn't, he doesn't buff it, though, the Metal Cooler. It's not that good, the Zenkai. But this Purple Janemba will be getting into Zenkai, so that'll be nice. It'll buff Perfect Cell, who helps out. And then, um, let's go look, actually, at the Powerful Opponent tag. Powerful Opponent, we gotta find the P. Let's play the... Aha! 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 Here we are. Yeah, so, if we do get a LF for Cooler, that could actually be really helpful for a Powerful Opponent to help give it some more uh, oomph, because there's not a lot of units that actually buff. I guess there are more now, but there's still not a ton that buff Powerful Opponent. There's a lot on Powerful Opponent, but most of them don't actually buff Powerful Opponent. And you want your units to obviously buff the tag you're running them on. But that could be kind of cool. We did just get the Yellow Frieza. We have Kid Boo and Broly, who I'd say are both still pretty good. We just got Purple Cell. We just got Vegito, who's a red. So honestly, I could see us getting a green potentially cooler an lf green cooler for helping out powerful opponent maybe a yellow too although that would kind of take away from full power frieza but maybe um they could they could make it a blue they could definitely just make it a blue cooler and just have him replace the other cooler that you know we have the other blue final form cooler right here and just have the lf cooler replace that as well here uh for lineage of evil they could use a new green Unless Golden Frieza gets a Zenkai sometime in the near future. But I could see us getting, especially now that I'm really looking at this. This is Frieza's eye for red. Um, again, we have the yellow full power Frieza. The Lineage of Evil. He doesn't buff Lineage of Evil, but, you know, he you get the, he can be ran on there. And he's, you know, good LF. Um, I'd say Lineage of Evil could also use a new blue. So again, maybe to replace the Zenkai, that cooler. But I feel like green would just be the best scenario. But of course, they don't always go with the best scenario. So we'll have to see. Um, but yeah, Piccolo being from the movie. Junemba being from uh, Powerful Opponent. Kind of makes me think we're going to be seeing an LF cooler soon. It could be for Black Friday. They could just go for Black Friday and give us LF cooler. And then maybe the LF Super Saiyan Goku from the movie. But I feel like that would be kind of disappointing for people. That's not exactly what they want for... A hype event like Black Friday. If we do in fact get a monthly LF for November, we could see potentially, I guess, an LF cooler to tie in with the movie, and he would also buff Lineage of Evil and Powerful Opponent, which would be really nice. Both tags, I feel like, you know, could use some some help. And then we could till still get our Black Friday, which if they want to continue on the trend of movies for like November, like November's a, a movies month, you know, they could give us an LF Super Gogeta and super janemba i feel like that would be a really good thing for black friday like that would be hype enough obviously people want mui for black friday or sort of hope trunks but i think super gogeta would also be a hype enough unit for black friday for people uh I, mui i just feel like yes we got ui for last black friday but i feel like mui is something you save for fourth anniversary i feel like that'd be a good time because we kind of have all the like big fusions i feel uh, unless you want to make transforming lf fusions which they've definitely probably will do at some point but i don't know i could see us being movies related maybe super gogeta maybe they just make it so we get a cooler for black friday alongside like goku or something not as hype as people would want i don't know we'll have to we'll have to see i mean it's it just because living up to the hype of ui omen last black friday is pretty like impossible since that's like the people lost their minds over that but yeah let me know what do you guys think we're going to get are you excited for the Janemba Zenkai and Piccolo, the new Piccolo. And what do you think we're going to get for November? Do you think we're going to get an LF Cooler? Do you think we might see LF Super Gogeta? Do you think it's going to still be MUI? Are you holding out hope for Sword of Hope Trunks? Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. But I just wanted to go over some of this, give some of my ideas on what we could potentially see. Of course, video and stuff tomorrow might make this picture a whole lot clearer for us. We'll have to see. Check back. You know, I'll have a video covering the video and stuff. So check back with that. 
but that's going to do it. Hope you all enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, hit the bell if you want notifications for every time I post a video. Go follow me on Twitch. We are actually talking about this stuff uh, yesterday, and you guys weren't there. I don't know why you weren't there, but you should be there in the live streams. They're fun. But, uh, yeah, that's going to do it. Hope you all are having the best of days. Staying happy and healthy. I'll catch you all tomorrow.